Hey guys, welcome to my channel. If you are new here, welcome. If you are a Holly Love Grove MUA subscriber and friend, thanks for coming back. I have some awesome stuff today that I am so excited to show you guys. Oops. Anyways, um, so there is a YouTuber named Kristen Leanne. I absolutely love her. I follow her on all of her social medias. Um, she just seems like a really great down to earth person. I know I've talked about her in other videos. She did a collaboration with Urban Decay. Um, she has a couple of eyeshadow palettes. She has a highlighter palette and um, a few shades of lipstick. Uh, this is what I'm using today. Um, her Kaleidoscope palette, her um, Beauty Beam highlighting palette, and the lipstick in the color Pulse. So if you're interested in how these products work, definitely stay tuned and watch the video in... I'm trying to just channel in my inner Kristen Leanne. I'm rocking her sweatshirt today, which I did purchase off of her website. I've got my Arctic Fox hair color. So um, I am Kristen Leanne up and ready to just rock this palette and show you guys how I created this look. So if you're interested, stay tuned. All right, so I've already done this eye. We're gonna do this eye together. I just wanna say that I love this. Love it. All right, so I already have my um, base down. I already have foundation, um, some blush, some bronzer, um, but I am gonna be using the Kristen Leanne highlighter and then this palette and her one of her lipsticks as well. So let's just go ahead and do this. Um, for the crease shade, I use this little beauty right here. So I'm just using a Morphe um, M513 brush. And then I'm going to, the mirror has like protective stuff over it, so it's not a, and I can't get it off. So I'll just use my little NARS mirror right here. And then just taking that into my crease. Um, I do want to say I literally had to tap into the color one time and that's how pigmented it is. And there's really no fallout. So that's exciting. This literally is such a bright, beautiful look with hardly any effort. So feeling pretty pumped. Alright, I am going to go just take one more swipe of that orange and just go back through this. Brighten it just a little bit. Yay! All right, so then what I'm gonna do <clears throat> is use the nifty little brush that came with the palette. I don't actually ever use brushes that come with palettes typically, but this is a cute little brush. And I just kind of wanted to show you guys um, how well it worked. So I am going to go into um, the shade Dye right here, which is my favorite shade. And I'm gonna use the tiny end of that brush just pick up a little bit of that and put that right on my lid. All right, so then using the same brush, I'm gonna go into, um, I'm dropping everything. I'm gonna go into the shade Leo here, and I'm going to put that over top of the purple colored dye that we just used. And it totally just changes it up 
and gives it like a holographic look. I absolutely love. All right, so then down here on my waterline, I'm gonna use this little wet and wild brush and I'm gonna go in to the color LCW right here and just take that right on the waterline. Then I'm gonna go in with the brush that came with the palette, the fluffy end, and just kind of smoke that out. Then I'm gonna take, this is a little um, detailer brush from um, Real Techniques. I am going to go in to the shade Lime Time and just pack that on my inner corner. See how quickly this is going and how beautiful it looks. All right, then I'm gonna take another tiny brush and I'm gonna go back in to the palette and take a tiny bit of the shade Brixton right here and just apply that up by the brow bone and it does not take very much of that at all. Then what I'm gonna do is take my Urban Decay 24-7 um, Glide-On Pencil in the color Perversion and just line up my waterline. Like so. All right, so I am going to do mascara and apply my lash on this eye, and we will be right back to do highlighter. Okay, so my lash and mascara is on, and we're ready to go. Um, it has been freezing cold in Tennessee, like, so cold. Um, so if you hear my fireplace going, or you hear popping and cracking, that's what it is. All right, so, um, moving forward. I do have some of the Becca um, Pink Haze powder down here under my contour, so I'm just going to brush that away. It's just a wet and wild brush. Alright, so I'm super excited about trying out the highlighter. Um, this is the first time that I've used any of these products. Um, I've had them sitting in a box. So anxious to try it, but I knew I wanted to fill for YouTube first. This is what the highlighter looks like. The packaging to all of the products that have her name on them are absolutely gorgeous. So here is what the inside looks like as the three shades. I'm actually gonna use this shade right here first. I feel like there's a shade in here for all skin types, skin tones. So, not so worried. Ooh, yes, girl. So I'm gonna bring that up a little. And then I get on this side. Yes, that is beautiful. Set on my nose. And on the cupid's bow. Yes, I love that. And again, it was this shade right here that I used. So pretty. So pretty. All right, so she does have a few lipsticks. Um, today I'm going to be using this one that is in the shade Pulse. Um, it does say that it is a waterproof, long-lasting liquid lipstick. So let's see. I am completely in love with this shade, just saying. I do have all of the shades, but this is the one that we're gonna be trying out today. We should have used some lip liner first but we'll make it work mm 
Yes, I love, love, love the color of this. Love it. And the packaging to this is super cute. I love the pink. I love how her name is right here in a heart. I love it, I love it, I love it. So um, in kind of wrapping this up, I am gonna do another video using the other palette that she came out with. Um, so be looking for that as well. And then we'll do a different lip. Um, there's also a single eyeshadow in the collection. I wanna use and do a video on that. So there will be more videos um, based on her collaboration with Urban Decay. So reviews on this, I love it. I feel like the shadows are so pigmented. I feel like they were very, very easy to use. Um, if you have been wanting to kind of experiment with bright colors and you're like, mm, I just don't know. I feel like these blended out so nicely, so smoothly. Um, definitely something that even if you're not a makeup artist you would be able to use and get to blend out um, very nicely I like how there is just such every bright color you could want is in this and then I feel like with these two shades right here you can completely change up how all of these shadows look um, as I did on my eyelid, I started out with a purple and then I added um, Leo over top and it completely changed the color of the purple. So I feel like you get all of these shades and then with these two, you can totally change up um, what the color looks like. The brush that came with it works beautifully. I just, this is exactly how I hoped that this palette would be. This is exactly how I hoped that the highlighter would be, the lipstick, everything is exactly how I wanted it to be. So I am in love with this. I do recommend this to you. If you do not have it, you should go and pick it up. Um, yeah, so this is it for the video. I hope you guys loved it. I hope you learned something awesome today. If you do love the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you are not subscribed, please do so that you don't miss out on any more awesomeness from my channel. All right, I will talk to you guys later. I hope you have a great day. Bye.